tuning out on Tobago with your boy Daniel and we are out here in the streets of Sangre Grande here today and we come out to ask this simple question that we ask around Trinidad and Tobago what you know we just want to know what you know if you know anything you know you may know I may not know tell them what to know yes man you may know I may not know but we just want to know what you know let we go where is your scrotum located my scrotum my belly <laughs> my belly yeah. Take a finger and point for me. Where's your scrotum located? Yeah. I'm here, so. I'm here, I'm here. I'm here, I'm So I see a real crab and thing. Smell the crab for me. <laughs> hey, that's the serious thing you're saying there. But I'm going to spell it, but I can spell it. But I'm going to spell it. One of the back. Try a thing. Spell the word crab for me. C A R C A R I B. <laughs> C A R I B. Right? You get a drink, Carib. I know you're a drink, Carib. I want to know if I'm quite down here. I know you're a drink, Carib. I know you're a drink, Carib. This is the next question here. Nothing too difficult, right? Can you tell me where's your scrotum located? Mazarena. Oh, Lord of mercy. What are the national birds of Trinidad and Tobago? Yeah, main bird. National birds, scarlet ibis, breed with it, breed with it, breed with it, brother. Yes, sir. I wanted to breed with it, right? You can't just answer this question just so you had to breed with it, right? What are the national birds of Trinidad and Tobago? Take a deep breath in. The hummingbird. A deep breath in. Out. In. Out. In. Out. <laughs> Name any three pronouns for me. You, 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 any, any three pronouns. Name any three pronouns. Joshua, Joshua, my name. <laughs> um, <laughs> TV. <laughs> I know. And um, camera. <laughs> scrotum. What do you mean by scrotum? Where's your scrotum located? You have a scrotum? Nah, nah. I don't no scrotum at all. Nah, I don't no scrotum at all. Why? <laughs> if you were to find out that you had a scrotum, what, what would you do if, if, if you were to find out you had a scrotum? Might be surprised. Might be surprised. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> How many fingers and toes do you have in total? I have 10 fingers and 20 toes. <laughs> Where is your scrotum located? Did you? Where is your scrotum located? Hmm. Take your finger and point for me. Where is your scrotum located? What part of your body is your scrotum located? Hmm. Try your thing, brother. Is is one thousand dollars you're competing for here today, you know, brother? Yeah. It's one thousand dollars, you know, brother. Take your finger and point for me. Where's your scrotum located? Well, are you a point here? Right, right here. Yeah. Here. Yeah. So your belly then. Yeah. Stomach. <laughs> <laughs> Where's your iris located? England. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking with you. I ain't, I ain't. Uh, I, I feel like you're having that thousand dollars at all. Uh. <laughs> what are you doing for the holiday? We have a holiday coming up on September the 24th. So, what are you doing for the holiday? Nothing, I have nothing to do. I might gotta go to school or something. <laughs> <laughs> Take your finger and point for me. Where's your scrotum located? Well, <laughs> they tell me point for you. Right, so where, where's your scrotum located? I know. So, you have a scrotum? No. You don't have a scrotum? No. 
So if you were to find out, so let's say you go to the doctor and the doctor informs you that, uh, brother man, you have a scrotum, what, what would you do? I will ask him the question where it is. <laughs> Which holiday are we celebrating on September the 24th? Emancipation. What can the government do? The sun is really hot today, boy. What yeah. can the government do to regulate the temperature of the sun? Yeah, that could be kind of hard. You use um, soda, solar, and regulate the, the, the sun from, from the heat and everything on, the, on, on, on earth. That ain't so correct? That ain't so correct? No, God! That ain't so correct? No, God, please, no! No! Can you name any three types of family structures for me? When you say family structure, what do you mean? Name three types of family for me. Indian, Chinese, Negro, Portuguese, white man, Syrian. Go ahead. Finish the song for me. Head, shoulders, knees, and head, shoulders, knees, and toes. Abacadaba want you to know which part me live long in the Caribbean. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes. But you know, my hand, the long maga matoto deep inside of your belly for so. All of the girls have my ball out for so. On fire! Here, we're, here, we're, here. Are we able to one more freestyle for me before I go? One more freestyle. One more freestyle. One more freestyle. I'm a second John from Jamaica or to the nation for you to under. Say you never know me as I know Ram Jinga, you only know me as a champion called the Bitter Lord, me selling it at the sun, a lot, me selling it at the rain. But when me get my money, me buy silver chain, me eat, I be a boy, me drink champagne. But I want to open one of the silver in him, and I hold just a old man trafficking. Ganja playing on for dance at the morning, because this one me live down in a little grandy. They said that the tongue is just a cool and deadly. Yes, I moved up and they come for me. But I want to open no call when they sell. Somebody knock it! Knock it! Knock it! Oh my word! Daddy Silver's there! Uh, real talent in Sangre Grande, but Sangre Grande it was nice. I'm gone. I love all you. out. This one is for the youths and them in the Caribbean, right? All the gangs in the East, West, North and South. Huh? It's all about the guns. But here what's going on? Don't forget the gold of and he strike the final blow. So we beg all the youth and them to come together as one and stop the killing for your black weather, man. That's how we the glock and the wicked man now. That's how we the AR-15 and the AK-47 and start reading the Bible in your right hand, you hear? Damn! Damn!